Hello everyone, hello YouTubers and endurance followers. Today I am in Lamet office. So this company is making uh, laser beam measurements and today I want to show you a live demo how we measure endurance laser power output. So the thing is that a lot of our customers and people who would like to, to try our lasers, they have a bit concerns if our lasers are really powerful and they have true rated continuous, which is very important, rated power. So today I'm going to show you how we do these measurements and I'm going to share uh, the results with you. So uh, we are going to use uh, an equipment. So this, uh, so this is actually the, the device. Uh, we show you just one one part of it. Uh, it is a laser beam uh, converter that converts um, photo power, uh, the light, actually into electric power. So with this guy that is already pressed up, we are going to do these measurements. So uh, the good thing that uh, you can actually go on, on the website to lamet, l a m e t dot r u and check it out on on their website. So to learn more about this device, so it can measure different parameters, really nice. So it can uh, measure wavelengths from 400 uh, uh, nanometers up to 11 thousand nanometers so that you can actually do measurements almost in very very wide spectra of wavelengths so uh, we're ready to start with uh, with, uh, in the, with the testing of 8 watt laser so we want to show you the uh, real real rated continuous power let's see what it shows okay so uh, the laser is already installed here it's connected to 12 volt power supply 5 amps uh, we do it like with all five amps, and uh, yeah, we are we are ready to measure. Let's go. Uh, okay. Okay. Now, uh, Michael will show closer, and I'm going to show you exactly, so you won't miss it. Okay. It's good. So, what is the peak? The peak that we have is about 7 watt. So 7 watt laser power is continuous. I pay your attention. It's a continuous and you see uh, rated, rated power of our laser. So it goes with that, with that laser power output. Let's measure our, our another device is 5.6 watt laser. We removed lens just to make sure that we have a clean. Okay, ready? Go. Okay. Okay. Let's let's do it once again because we did it a little bit uh, too too fast. Okay. Now we're going to see the distribution of the laser power. It is five five point four. This is continuous power. Five point four watts. So it's very very close to what we we actually announce. So uh, let's move further and let's test 3.5 watt laser. Okay, what do we have here? We have 3.3 watt continuous power output. Okay, let's move on and test 5. Oh, let's test 10 watt laser. Do not forget. 
forget to have additional cooling for for the fans. So that we have additional power supply here. Ready? Push. Punch. You see that we have a great peak. Okay, we have the maximum. 8.5 watt. So this is a peak that we measure. So you saw a live video, live demo of showing our real rated power output. So it means that this power can go continuously. When we say about 10 watt laser, it means that 10 watt is an impulsive mode when you have a very, very short period of time. So continuously you have like 8.5, then it's decreasing a little bit uh, for seven, uh, for 8 watt laser we have continuous power like 7 watt for 5 watt it's really really powerful it's 5.3 and 3.3 for 3.5 watt so we are very very close to to that numbers that we indicated so the one thing that you have to be very careful that some of uh, diodes they they vary so it could be a little bit more powerful a little bit less powerful and also let me tell you that this uh, system does not catch peaks so when we're talking about peak power output when like 10 watt laser it has peaked of 10 watts so here we only have continuous measuring of continuous power output so hope that you like this video please share it with your friends and have a wonderful laser cutting and laser engraving with endurance and don't forget to check out the website of lamet.ru and check out about their devices thank you